Yo, 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 TNT Dynamite the Explosive One. I'm the man on the sticks. And we're playing Magic Duels. That's right. <laughs> we're back. You didn't think it was going to keep going. It's going to keep going, man. This train ain't stopping. All right. So, on a two days episode, stop showing me your microtransaction stuff. I'm not doing that. It's never going to happen. But on today's episode, I'm going to go into the store and I'm going to confirm. Now, I'm not using, what is this, items? Oh, okay. All right, I'm not using any real money, but I do have 345 a coins a setup. So I'm going to buy a couple of boosters. What series should I buy it from? I don't know, but Eldritch Moon sounds absolutely amazing. So, let's buy one from Eldritch Moon. Yeah, dude. Confirm it, dude. Let's purchase it up. Boom. What did I get? Let's open it up. Alright, let's see what I got. Got some white cards. Enchant creature. 2 plus 2 plus 2. And has a uh, sacrifice of permanent. This creature gains flying. Ooh. Not too shabby. What else do we get? Chittering host and a grief rats. At the beginning of your combat, uh, if you own, if you own both of them, own oh, <laughs> let me read it right. At the beginning of your, of combat on your turn, if you both own and control graph rats and a creature named a midnight scavengers, exile them and mail them into chittering host. But I don't have the other one. Waxing Moon. Transform up to one target werewolf you control. Creatures you control gain trample until the end of turn. Okay. Don't have any werewolves. Whenever you cast an Eldrazi creature spell <laughs> with converted mana cross seven or greater, draw two cards. Okay. Ah. The Marvac... Marvok Markov Crusader. Lifelink. Markov Crusader has haste as long as you control another vampire. 4-3. Okay. And my gold is a Spirit of the Hunt. When Spirit of the Hunt enters the battlefield, each other creature you control that's a wolf or a werewolf gets plus zero plus three into the end of the turn. Wait a that I don't have any wolves. This isn't a very good booster at all. All right, I'm not mad though. Let's continue. Eldritch Moon Starter Box Awarded. <laughs> what? Oh no, I got a whole box of it now? Emerging Horror. Use Emerge to unleash massive Eldrazi on unprepared foes, dude. I love it when my pros are unprepared. Select an Archetype? Oh man, dude, what do I? Oh, let's do another blue black. You know I want to. But I'm not going to. What are we gonna do? You wanna do green blue? Black red, dude. Oh, look at all the different color. Black and green. You know I love black and green. These are all locked though, so I can't even pick any of those. I gotta go down here. Alright, let's do a you know what? Oh, I was gonna do white red too. Oh, we can't do white red. Let's do white red. I don't know what I'm picking, but F it, dude. We're going for it. Welcome to the Deck Wizard. I've been here before. Creatures and more. Wait a minute. I already have these. This is all stuff I already own. Alright, look. We're leaving a Deck Wizard because I want to buy another... I want to buy another booster. Compare, uh, oh, I get it. It's it's just how many I have in the in the box. All right, let's go. What are we going to pick? Let's take something from the Ammonothketh because it's new. And, I mean, it has a cool name, I think. All right, yeah, let's buy it. <clears throat> Purchase successful. Give me my Ammonketh booster. Open it up, man. Now, you guys are going to have to let me know if any of these are good, because I have no idea, besides reading them. Whenever you cycle or discard a card, 
Hakama Sentinel deal gets plus one plus one to the end of the turn. Okay. I'm not mad at that. And we got the Karuchi of Zeal. I like Karuchi. Probably less than Chris Brown. Each creature you control when Karuchi of Zeal enters the battlefield target creature can't block this turn. Enchanted creature gets plus one plus one and has haste. Okay, it's only it's cheap too. We got a three two flash pouncing cheetah. That's an old school card. Ooh, we got Karen Charioteer. He's a three three trample for three. Other creatures you control have trample. That's not bad. It's not bad at all. Bone Picker has a cost of three less to, to cast if a creature died this turn. Flying and Death Touch, 3-2. So the thing is to get a creature to die and then they cost one. That's pretty good. Heaven deals X damage to each creature with flying. Do I have Earth too? Aftermath. Earth deals X damage to each creature without flying. Oh. I don't think I got both of them. I think I just got Heaven. But uh, I mean, I'm cool with that. All right, dude, uh, let's go to my card collection. And on this episode, we're gonna make a deck real quick, man. I'm gonna give myself a 15 minute time limit to come up with a deck, dude. Uh, show all cards, show all cards. Oh, this is all I got. So I did not get Earth, but I did get Heaven. All right, so from the time we get in here, we gotta go to battle mode. My decks, create a new deck. What color are we gonna make this deck? I don't know, we were thinking about going uh, white, red. So maybe let's just do that, let's just go white, red. Now a lot of these white cards that we have, we've already seen them. So we're not, we're not, gonna, we're not gonna do that. We're gonna put in two reprisals, cause you need them, you need them dude. Uh, enters the battle, you gain two for each creature. No, I don't want that because that they synergize with each other, but I only have one. I like this guy. He's not bad. He's cheap, and we're going to put one of those in. All right. What does this guy do? Uh, sacrifice a primate. This creature gains flying into the end of turn. Absolutely, dude. You can never have too many auras. We're going to skip those, though. I know. Funny. You, you just heard me say how important they are, and then I'm skipping one. Helioids, Pilgrim, Enter the Battlefield, you search your library for another card, Villain, Absol, put it in. Now we need a couple of those. At least two. Anything else would be uncivilized. Flying First Strike, boys, let's put one in. This. It's expensive, man, but we're going to put one. We're going to put two of these, because I like it. I'm gonna put you in, cause you're my strong boy. We're gonna put you in, and then we're gonna, I could put two of you in, but I mean, you're super expensive. Now we're gonna switch over to our red cards. This is speed deck building. I don't know if you're familiar, but there it is. We're gonna put that in, because it's a goblin, dude. Why not? Goblin gains flying into the end of turn. Dude, put one in. Should we put the Karuchi in? It's an enchantment, dude. Whenever it enters the battlefield, our creature can't block this turn. Enchanted creature gets plus one, plus one. It's not bad, dude. It has a, it has a little little bang for its buck. Sacrifice Ember Hauler to deal two damage to target creature or player. Put it in, dude. What do you do? You're just a two one. We're not interested, man. We need powers and abilities. Enchanted creature gets plus one, plus one haste and attacks. Is each turn if able. If Entangled Creatures dies, you may search your library for a card named Influence of Blood Hunt and put it into your hand. So it helps to have two of those. This card right here, this this served one of my opponents very well. So we're gonna rock that, man. Yeah, that's a good card, man. This right here, it's two damage divided any way I want. Let's put one of those in there. Dragon Fodder? Put two goblin tokens onto the battlefield? Uh, yes, please. Oh, well, well, let's look at this one first. As long as Flame Can is enchanted, it's our trample and has. Alright, 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 alright. Oh! Yeah, let's put two of those in, dude, because those things can get big, get big pretty quick. 
What the heck is Renown? I don't even know what that is. Uh, when the creature deals combat damage to a player, if it is removed, to put a plus one plus one counter on it, it becomes and it becomes removed. Oh, he's not bad, but I'm I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep looking, man. We need bigger than that. Her chieftain gets plus one plus one as long as you control a forest. We're not playing forest though. This is the trample mouse or dog or whatever that thing. It's a hound. It's a scrapyard mongrel, but we don't have any of those that makes it powerful. Gain control of target creature until the end of turn. Untap that creature until the end of turn gets plus blah 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 blah. I'm gonna put a couple of those in, dude. We got a few more cards we can put in. Sacrifice an artifact, Barrage Ogre deals two damage to target creature or player. Oh my god, if only I had artifacts. This thing looks amazing. Blood Pyre Elemental. Sacrifice Blood Pyre Elemental deals four damage to target creature. Activate this ability as you Oh, so I can just I can just sacrifice it at any point in time to deal that? That's not too shabby. Destroy target land into the maw of hail deals 13 damage to target creature i'm gonna put one of those in dude we're gonna put one of those in and then we're gonna put in uh there was something else i liked as long as flame can is enchanted i've already got how many flame cans do i have i have two in here already this creature deals combat damage to a player if it isn't removed, put it, oh yeah, let's put you in too, man. All right, let's toss some lands in here. Let's toss some lands in, cause we're running, we're running short on time. Let's see if we got the, the red white land. We do, we've got two of them. Put them both in. Do we have any more red white land? We got these guys, we'll put two of those in. Actually, we only need one. And then we're gonna put in Let's put in 10, 11 of these, 11 of these. That gives us 55 cards. Uh, let's look at the analytics real quick. I feel like we're getting kind of close to the time period. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted the analytics, deck stats, boom. 15, 15, and we got, we got land. We got land, we got equal amount of land. Let's put one, one more of those in one more of those in and then we're, we'll find some other creatures that we like in fact maybe some artifacts what the hell is this thing emerge when you cast it uh it of the horrid swarm put two plus one inside creature i i can't use that dude don't even read it if you can't use it it's a flash dude it's a five seven for okay i get it i get it these things are are all very very similar I understand no we're not gonna put you in bottle gnomes no should we put this in if equipped does equipped count as an enchantment I don't know all right we're not gonna put any of those in do we got anything multicolored we don't all right we're running short on time we're hustling a little bit I'm just I'm just looking around we got one of those boys uh, we could put another one of you in. You're really not bad, dude, but we're gonna put in some direct damage. We don't have any of those. Take one of those out. We'll keep two of them in. Uh, how many of these do we got? Now we got another one. And then we're gonna toss another bird in and we're done, all right? And I feel like we did good on time. Should we toss another bird in or should I toss another enchantment in? You know, I said no to these guys. We're putting one in. We already have one. We're not We're not going to have two. <laughs> I'm just going to put another bird in, dude. I'm running. Boom. Quickest deck I ever made in my life. Quickest deck. All right. Uh, how do you save? All right, dude. Yeah, I, I did that. I want to go back, save changes, dude. Look at the control, dude. The speed is good. Not a lot of power and not a lot of synergy. But we are going to... No, not not create the new deck, dude. Name it, dude. Name the, name the deck. We want to... Create new deck store. Uh, I don't know how to name it. I don't remember how. This is going to sound terrible. 
but I don't remember how to name the deck. All right, so we're just going to leave, and we're going to play with it. Solo battle. And we're going to play with deck. Deck the deck, dude. Inspect the deck. Oh, we know this lady. We know her. She might have beat us one time, but we're back with a new deck. We're ready to go. Speed deck building. First time gameplay. Only at the crazy town. <laughs> All right, man. Let's see what we can do. I'm hoping that we can that we build a competent deck, but you know who who am I to judge? All right, we got a lot of land here, but I'm gonna actually keep this hand. It's not a bad hand, even though we have n no mountains. All right, that comes into play tapped. I hope you realize that it's not gonna be oh perfect. That's what we needed right there. Alright, so we got a first turn 1-1 one, one flyer. That's gonna cause him some trouble. He's already I can already see her sweating. And it's not just because I'm a sexy beast. Like I give a hell that you put out that guy. I give no craps. Oh, that's perfect, because that comes out. And we can't cast anything yet, but we can attack. Are we going to take two next turn? We absolutely are, but you know what? That's only until... That's only until we deem it no longer necessary. Alright, that's fine. That's fair. That's fair. I expected you to attack. We're keeping him honest, man. He's only one turn ahead of us right now. But we got ball players too. Alright, let's get this out there. Oh, that destroys a land. It's six mana, though. That's crazy good, strong. All right, we're going to cast our 2-2 two, two boy. That's right. We're going to attack him again. He's going to take it. He has no choice. I keep saying he is clearly a female. All right, man. We're not too concerned. We're not too concerned. Skip your attack phase. That's more like it. What is this? All right, we know what this does. We know what that does. We're not too concerned about that thing. Uh, can attack or block or use activated abilities can't be activated. This is not an activated ability, but it would be nice to have it not attack or block. Uh, I can kill it in two turns, provided I get the necessary mana. This guy can come out most likely next turn. So yeah, I think I am going to just gain control of your creature. And then I'm just going to attack you with everything that I have, except for my 2-2. Two -two. You know what? Yeah, except for the 2-2. Two -two. Are you gonna block? You're thinking about it. Oh no, you're just gonna take. It's gonna take all that damage, huh? I don't know if I would have done that if I were you, princess. Well, excuse me, princess. All right, attack me for three. You know what? I'll take it. No, I'll take the three. I have no concerns. What is this? Another one. I expected this. We expected this. We knew this was going to happen. This is what this guy does. This is what that deck does. Alright, let's get that out there in the open. Yeah, we want to do this. And then we want to look for... Uh Oh, you know what? I think I thought this guy was something else. Well, shit. That that's not, that's actually not what I wanted. We'll attack you for one, dude. But at least we got some blockers, man. <laughs> I thought that was the guy that got the art. The uh, 
the things out of my library. I thought he was the, like the guy for six mana. Or for seven mana. That's alright. Oh no. He has a plan, dude. He has something up his, up his sleeve, man. He has something up his sleeve. Can I block that guy instead? No, actually, can I block this guy instead? Dude, he's definitely going to grow them up. He's going to grow them up until the end of certain creatures. One one for each creature you control. No, dude, he growthed them. Oh, he growthed this big boy, too. Dang it. All right, that's fine. That's fine. I take a lot of damage. All right, this ain't looking good, man. It's not looking good for us out here. All right, let's destroy this land and deal 13 damage to that creature. All right, we can't we can't attack. We can't. We got a block now. We're on defense. I'm very very close to top decking. I'm a little concerned about that. All right. Uh let, let's stem the bleeding. If we're gonna kill some, we're gonna take it out, man. Alright, I can lock that man up next turn. Dude, get your body harvest guy out of here, man. Stop. Why do you have so much stuff? She's so strong. Alright, alright, give me something good. That's not it, dude. That ain't it. That ain't it, fam. That ain't it. All right, so I'm going to take four. <laughs> Next turn, I have to get a life-altering card. I have to get a life-altering card. That's all right, man. We're, we're still in here. We're still in. You think I gave up? Do you think I gave up? I didn't give up. Yo, even if we lose, which, I mean, we're, we're probably going to lose. I'm playing this deck again, alright? Because I don't feel like it got a fair shake. I don't feel like it got a fair shake, man, you know? I feel like we're up against somebody that's really, really strong. And, you know, the shakes aren't as fair as they could be. Alright, just, just continue, man. Just, just end my life, dude. I'm gonna practice something because he's gonna attack, right? No, he's gonna ca he's gonna cast another body hauler. Just attack me. Stop BMing. Why is the computer BMing? All right. So what I want to do is I want to block, confirm, and then I want to wait. No, I want to con. Then I want to stop timer. Yeah, and then I want to. Oh, you can only use this ability as a sorcery. All right, then continue. We're done. Just, just end me, dude. All right, yeah. All right, man. S speed deck did not work, but that's all right, man. Thank you for joining me for this episode of TNT Dynamite Plays a Magic the Gathering Duels. Until next time, man. I'm out. <laughs>